Now, it's been a week with a lot of reopenings here in Ohio. Retail, outdoor seating at restaurants and hair salons, just to name a few. And more are set to open by the end of the month. But the tough reality for some businesses is that some will not be able to come back from this. NBC4's Eric Halpern is live in Clintonville tonight, where one local business has already made that tough decision. Eric? Mark, this is Paper Moon Art Studio. It's a children's art studio here in Clintonville, and the owner just announced a few days ago that she is closing this studio, and already some of the kids that came here made this sign thanking her, saying this isn't goodbye forever, and owner Kristen Merrick says it's not, but it is time to close this studio. It's been here for five years, but like many other businesses, it has been closed since March. Cleanup for moving out of the space has already started. The space isn't that big, so if kids were to come back, social distancing would have been a huge challenge. When Merrick realized she wasn't going to have summer camps this year, plus the time she's already lost, she says it would have just been too big of a loss to reopen. It's very sad. My kids would say, turn off the waterworks, mom, because as soon as somebody asks me, I start crying. It's really hard. Um, I've, I've become, uh, you know, I've met so many families and so many kids, and we've had such great experiences here. I hope that this isn't the end of Paper Moon. It's just a pause in, in, in this space. And Merrick says she is looking forward to possibly doing some pop-up pop -up events when it's safe to do so. Now, another local business just down the street, also catered to kids, announced earlier this week it is closing for good as well. Live and local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4.